tough one coming along, mate. Yeah, it's going alright. Um, yeah, fair bit of a fair bit of practice um, with the amount of time that we've had. So, been trying to learn and, and get there, but um, yeah, I've been doing some stuff with my brother from back home um, over Zoom, so that's been alright. But yeah, getting there, it's it's, it's hard, but nah, it's something that I do in my spare time and I like. So yeah, it's good. Family band, so. Yeah, hopefully. We'll see how we go. Family duo. <laughs> Speaking of your brother, or one of your brothers, you could potentially be playing against him in a couple of weeks. Does that ever happen? Yeah, so I think they're coming over Monday, I think. So it'll be a bit strange. I don't think I can go see him. So it's, you know, he's here for about a month or so and I, I can't can't go see him. So hopefully we get the opportunity to play against each other. But no, uh, because it hasn't happened yet. So um, no, hopefully, yeah, they go all right and he's... Uh, Hopefully, maybe I'll get to see him at some stage, or we'll see what happens. What's, what's, what is his mindset like? Have you spoken to him about what that move's going to be like? Yeah, it's obviously, um, you know, obviously it's something that I'd probably rather not do, but, you know, everyone wants to see footy back, and West Coast want to see footy back, and um, obviously there's other teams coming over as well. So I think they, everyone just wants to play, and the fans just want to see footy back, and, and um, yeah, every, everyone can't wait. So he's, he's pretty, pretty good with it, and he's all good. Has he, has he let on anything that they, you know, can and can't do, and or they may be doing that? You think, oh wow, really? Ah, uh, not really. He's been pretty tight-lipped about it. Um, but we sort of know. Um, we're all sort of in the same boat. Like they're pretty much going to treat it as, you know, their residents living in Queensland. So it's the same thing. Like it's, um, you know, they can't do the same things that we can't do. It's pretty much so. It's worst things in the world living on the Gold Coast playing footy, isn't it? That's it. Look, look at the, the this weather's amazing. <laughs> um, so it's not freezing cold like Melbourne where yeah, they're pretty lucky to be coming over here. So um, hopefully they enjoy the weather and um, the Gold Coast, yeah, is a, not, a lovely place. It'd be pretty tough living on a golf course and not being able to play. <laughs> like, that'd be the hardest. <laughs> That's the thing. I, I don't think my brother can play golf. So um, yeah, I think he'll be fine. But yeah, a lot of, a lot of blokes in the AFL love their golf. So that'll be, that'll be difficult. But yeah, my brother's no good, so it's fine. <laughs> uh, round, round one, that was a while ago, um, you had a... You had a rough week leading into that. Yeah, it's, um, yeah, it's well, not funny, but it was just uh, bad timing, I guess. I obviously got through the pre-season um, well and obviously didn't get injured or anything, which was awesome. And then come round one, I was, uh, yeah, a bit crook. So obviously with, um, you know, the coronavirus, and it was a bit unknown, so it was pretty important to stay home and um, didn't want to get anyone else sick with everything going on. So, but yeah, it was all good, just a bit of a cold and unlucky to miss out, but, um, yeah, I'm, I'm fit and ready to go now and yeah, hopefully ready to go to play round two. Were you going to play round one? I'm not too sure. Um, yeah, I, I was ready to go and if I was get picked then I would have played. But um, yeah, everyone's there to fill a spot so everyone's ready to go and um, yeah, we'll see what happens next week. Does that make that eight week period a little bit more frustrating? There's another eight weeks to wait before you play a game? Yeah, it was a little bit, um, but you know, every, everyone's going through the same thing, and um, these things happen. You know, I, I was sick for a week, but um, yeah, everything, everyone's going through the same thing, and I'm just happy now to be back and uh, back to training on the Gabba. I actually didn't get to train on the Gabba before round one, so it was my first time coming back, and um, I've loved every bit of it. So can't wait to start playing games. How's um, how's match simulation been? Like, is there still a little rusty which you can understand or, or is there a slickness back? Or? Yeah like it is a little bit rusty you come from you know training in pairs that's all you can do um, to you know full-on contact match sim I think we've got 80 minutes this week but it's understandable that everyone's a little bit rusty but um, I think everyone's sort of blown the cobwebs out last week and we're ready to go this week so hopefully get a good run on, on Friday and ready to go for next week.